It's Happy Friday. How are we all doing today? Alright, today it didn't go exactly how I was planning. I worked late. Didn't get home till late. Uh, it's now 7 o'clock and I'm just getting to making a video. I was planning on doing a video response to uh, White Boy M. Do. I was going to do the same as him and call the uh, call up and up to New Jersey and got home way too late. So, I had to think in my head and pull out all my papers and see what to talk about. Well, really there wasn't much to think about because I happened to catch a few things today. Um, between last night and this morning when I got up looking at my, uh, looking at the news and all. First thing, I don't know, I think a bunch of people probably have already seen it. It's a uh, video that's uh, gone viral out there in the past two days. Uh, Facebook parenting for the troubled teen. Um, I thought the other video was excellent. Got a father that sits there and reads out what his daughter posted on Facebook totally wrong. Put her, put, put the father down, put the mother down, put, the, put them both down, and was very rude about it. And it's, I can understand his his viewpoint. She thought she was getting away with it. He didn't let it get away with it, and he ended up blowing eight bullets into her laptop. Laptop that he paid for. So, not no big deal there, you know, and he says, you get a laptop, fine. Well, I thought the video was pretty good, so I posted it on my Facebook wall. Started getting comments, and one of my Facebook friends um, immediately thought he was an asshole. Yeah, maybe he is. I don't know. I liked it. Either way, she didn't like it, said that he was an asshole, blah, 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 it was, give a bunch of bullshit, and I was defending him. I liked it. I defended him. I think more parents need to be more stern with some of their kids. And after three or four comments, and I mean, I didn't think nothing of it. I thought we were just having a chat back and forth with comments, you know, you comment, I comment, that was it. Next I know, she's there. Take care. Goodbye. I'm like, what the fuck? You, you, yes. Not really deleting me as a supposed friend, you know. Yeah, she deleted me. Just because I had a different view of hers. That's all I can figure. I had a different view of hers. She then proceeded to remove me, remove my channel from hers, and deleted half half the comments on them. Come on, girl. You're 40 years old. Grow the fuck. Up. You know, get a look, get a like something. I know you have you have your problems in life, but damn, come on, girl. There is no reason to act that way. That that's a, that's a, the way a thirteen year old acts. All right, I know thirteen year olds that act more grown up than that. I I couldn't believe it. Just blew my mind that she's gonna sit there and delete and say I you know basically I don't want to know you anymore just because I had a different viewpoint. Well, you know what? This world has a bunch of people with different viewpoints, and they're all allowed to do it. That will bring me to my next, my next subject. Uh, the I don't know who, if you've seen it. Uh, you had the father that blew up his two sons. Unbelievable. And we're gonna have now, from what I understand, WBC, the Westboro Baptist Church. They're going to go there and protest. And why are they protesting? Because it happened in Washington, in the only Washington state, and the only reason it happened in Washington state was because they passed same-sex marriage. Now, <laughs> am I missing something there? I, I, it's bad enough that they have been protesting at funerals of all of our soldiers. It's pitiful what they do. But to sit there and then bring this into it, uh, over this, I swear, you know, I know you guys are just looking for the media attention. And every time you bring the media attention more toward you, everybody hates you that much more. So I don't know what you think you're accomplishing. You think that you're going to change America that way? It's not going to happen. The um, last thing I want to mention is, as of last night, I bought my tickets to the Playlist Live. Um, I've been in YouTube active uh, for all, 
a month and a half, and I'm going to my first YouTube event. I figured, what the hell? It's in Orlando. Uh, it's a lousy 150 miles drive. I got a friend I can stay with while I'm up there. So I'm going to go up there. I'm going to have fun, and uh, hopefully I get to meet some uh, fellow YouTube fellow YouTubers. Uh, I'd love to. Uh, you know, there's too many there to even list that I'd love to see. Um, Tyler Oakley, of course, I want to see him. So, uh, that's, that's what I'm doing come next month. I think I've, it's the 23rd to the 25th, uh, something like that, of March. So, that's what I'll be doing then. So, that's all I got for today. Uh, everybody have a great day, night, whatever it may be for you. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.